Hey guys, welcome to another vlog of mine. Today's video is dedicated. Tomorrow is my sister's 28th birthday and we're gonna have a little Hawaiian kind of aloha summertime fun spring vibes party in the backyard. So yeah, we already have tons of um, islandy decor anyways that we were gonna uh, decorate our backyard with just regardless but we're gonna go to the store and get a few more items to make the vibes even more aloha -y. <laughs> so we're headed to the store and I'll see you guys when we get there oh let me show you well yeah I'll see you guys when we get there this is Dale the birthday girl hi tomorrow you'll be how old or how young 28 years young. 28. And so, yeah, guys, we just got back from the store. And so we got, just like I told y'all, it is Corona season. So it will not be that many people. How many people? Like 15 people, about 15 or less here. So, and, and we're going to be outside. So that's good. Social distancing, but having a good time. So we got food and we got some decorations. Let me show you guys what we got so i want y'all to know do not sleep on dollar tree as y'all already know because her little theme is like i told y'all outdoors hawaiian bahama vibe summertime fine so we have look at these cute straws here they're like flamingo straws and then these open into umbrellas so that'll be cute we got a whole bunch of la 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 lays. Everybody's gonna wear a lay. Um, this is her own personal cup, tropical vibes. But yeah, we got these lays, a whole bunch of lays, and then we got these cute little tropical dishes, which we're gonna put something in here. I'm not sure what, but we got two of those. Look at this cool pineapple. And I think we're gonna put the silverware on here. I'm not sure. And everything that we have is, um, what's the word? Throwawayable, you know. And then look at these cool plates, like summery vibes. And then look at this. It's a half a plate. It's a lime. So maybe if you want a little smaller plate, you know what I'm saying? Trying to watch your weight. Cute. And then we got this really cool tablecloth here which is very tropical then we got a banner it's a luau banner um really nice we're gonna hang up somewhere and then look at these napkins this is my favorite look little drinks cocktail summertime so that's gonna be cute and then oh, more lays and then we got these what are these called lanterns to hang and they have like little pineapples and palm trees on them we got a lot of them and they have light so we're gonna hang these all in the backyard we gotta get the shot cups you feel me and i'm so excited to show you guys what we're gonna do with these sand buckets here want to say hello to nipsey hello nipsey look paw come on do it for the camera hey you did it hey. I'll show you guys what um, the food is looking like once we finish. So I'm going to make my signature buffalo chicken dip. Danielle is going to make her signature pasta salad. And then we're also going to do a fruit kebab tray. <laughs> Nipsey is in full costume. Nipsey! Nipsey. Look, Nipsey. Nipsey! Oh gosh. Look, Nipsey. Guys, anyways, I wanted to show you guys how it turns out. So. This is the food. Well, the fruit kebabs go here and the buffalo dip goes here. We haven't brought it out, but there's the cake, little cookies. This is a strawberry limeade. Look at these cute straws with the umbrellas. Pineapple lit. Pasta salad, some margaritas with the cool flamingo cups. This is a whole vibe right here. Look at that. We got palm trees in the back. You feel me? It'll look better once it gets night outside. We got a grass skirt. Why is this so... Put that back a little bit. Flamingo. 
more trees. Here's a bar, nice and covered. We got 85 South Show on. Happy birthday. More palm trees, more drinks. This is gonna be so much fun. And we have fake grass in here just for the aesthetic. And there is Nipsey Blanco. Just let him, it's keeping him occupied, anything. And with the, let me go get my leg and we'll be back when we're ready. Hey guys, so today is uh, <laughs> Saturday actually, and my sister's birthday has passed, all that jazz. So, say hello to my pup, Nipsey. Right now I am sitting outside of a vitamin shop. My mom went in there to grab some vitamins and some tea and stuff, whatever. And tonight we are actually having Juicy Crab at home. So I will be cooking um, DIY little Juicy Crab, Juicy Seafood, um, little situation at home so we're gonna go to Walmart and I'm gonna we already have a lot of the seasonings anyways because I've made this before but this time I'm gonna vlog it and so I need to go get some crab legs go get some shrimp some corn I don't know if we're gonna do potatoes this time but yeah just go grab all that stuff so we can make the juices juicy juicy fruit dee 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 juicy hello nipsy <laughs> so yeah guys um i'm excited because i'm starving and i really 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 have a taste for some crab legs i was just gonna go to juicy seafood and get an order but i was like oh i can just get a bigger bang for my buck if i just make it and it can last longer and we can have more crab legs so that's that on that um me and my sister just got done nipsey y'all the dog is still like not used to seeing i don't know people in public i don't know but anyways me and my sister just got done wrapping episode seven of mvp millennials voice podcast which you guys should check out uh the thing you can click right here on the screen it'll be right there you can watch us on youtube or you can listen to us on spotify so that's cool um yeah be sure to check that out and i really want to get back into vlogging like really for real for real for real for real get more consistent Okay guys, it's way later and I'm finally back home from the store and we're about to get this crab boil cracking. So I already have eggs boiling um, and then in here, this is our little steamer. You can't really see because it's dark, but it's water at the bottom part of it and it steams it. So I put the corn in first because that needs to uh, obviously cook. Cook a little longer than like our crab legs that we got from Publix are pretty much already cooked um, our shrimp are already cooked we're just gonna kind of put them in the steamer for a second and then put in the sausage right now what I'm about to do is get ready to make the sauce the sauce I have all the seasonings that I'm using sitting out here now and garlic and all that good stuff and unsalted sweet butter pepper all kinds of stuff so I'm going to show you guys what I'm using okay so I'm going to be doing a half of a tablespoon for each thing so first I'm going to start with the onion powder here onion powder then I'm going to go in with the lemon pepper and I'm going to do more lemon pepper because I really like lemon pepper um, and then some Old Bay which we're pretty much out of Old Bay so I'm going to put all that in there bingo and then paprika some people call it paprika one of those some accent some garlic salt or you can do garlic powder um, it doesn't matter and then some oregano not too much though but some oregano and then some crushed red pepper okay and then some ground black pepper but I'm not gonna do too much of this um because you don't need a lot but about half of a half tablespoon so about that much okay 
Then I'm gonna go in with my Slap Your Mama Cajun seasoning. You can do the Slap Your Mama, or you can do the Tony's whatever Creole. Um, it doesn't really matter. I think I'm actually gonna do both. Some of that. Let me go in with a little bit more of that. Okay, that's good. So this is how the seasoning looks. I'm gonna mix that all together. I'm making this for three people. My, me, my sister, and my mom. Um, I hope this is enough. I kind of feel like maybe I should do more. What do y'all think? I don't know. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna add some more to this. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Now this is the butter. This is a sweet cream butter that I showed y'all. So what I'm gonna do now is add in the chopped up onions, and then this is a half of a, of an onion. If it was more people, then you would do a whole onion. But since it's just three of us, then I'm just gonna do a half. And then I'm also gonna add in the mixed garlic. You can do fresh garlic or like how we're doing. And the recipe calls for a lot of garlic, so. <coughs> Me too, especially with seafood, I'm glad you said that. And if you don't like as much garlic, then of course you can make it how you want, but we like garlic over here and especially with seafood. So I'm just going to let this kind of cook and stuff when the onions start to turn a little more translucent. Then we'll add in the seasoning. So I will be back. Okay guys, now here's the seasoning and now I'm going to go ahead and add that in. Kind of half and then the other half. And then I'm going to add in the red, the rest, and I'm going to let this cook on low just so that all the flavor simmers together and everything is nice and good. Oh wait, no, my bad, rewind, back to the sauce. I forgot I have to add in some of this um, chicken stock. You can do chicken stock or chicken broth. Um, and not too much and not too less. So about half of the box. If you have more people that you're feeding, then I would do the whole box. Okay guys, you see the crab legs that we have and we, we bought, my mom bought them from Publix fresh and unseasoned. So what I'm going to do now is take the crab legs and put them in here. Sorry guys, the light is kind of bad because our light bulb went out over the stove. But anyways, as you can see I have the corn and the sausage already in there. So we're going to go ahead and add in the legs to be steamed. Down here at the bottom is water, um, lemons cut up, garlic cloves, uh, and a chicken, what is it? A chicken and herb little stock thingy, just to add flavor while the steam is coming up. Okay guys, so here is the sauce done. Um, my mom says it tastes good, so hopefully it does. And then over here, we have the crab legs, the shrimp, and the sausage in here. And then over here is the corn and the egg. We're not doing potatoes this time. Back on the cam. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put the crab legs, the shrimp, sausage, eggs, and the corn in these giant bags and pour sauce on it. And then we're going to mix it up like a juicy crab. Stay tuned for more. Okay, guys, these are the bags, the finished product. As you can see, we got corn in here. We got some shrimp, the sausage, crab legs, all that good stuff. It looks pretty darn good, and I know it's going to taste pretty darn delicioso. Look at that. Looks amazing, smells amazing. All righty. Hey guys, today is Sunday. I forgot to tell y'all I'm going to the car wash. I'm talking really fast because my battery is about to die. But I wanted to show you guys that I am 
uh, getting my car washed. Look how messy this car is. I mean, so dirty.